Good morning, guys. You have yet another Thunderbird bass I'd like to review. This is my 1966 Thunderbird 2 in factory finish Cardinal Red. Very rare color, unusual. I'm very lucky to get this bass. I just love it. I've uh, unimaginatively dubbed it Big Red, but as you can see, it's a big bass. Um, for the most part, it's stock. The knobs are not original. Um, and the fret, the, the fingerboard has had a refret. Other than that, it's bone stock. It's an excellent shape. Um, you can see some really honest player wear right here. Somebody really liked to dig in with their thumb and they played in one spot. I, I, I like stories like that. That's interesting. It tells me a little bit about the basis. You know, previous owner and how he played. You know, he played right here. Again, Thunderbirds are known for their sustain, their piano-like sound. They have an all mahogany slab body. It's one piece. Very cool. The neck is also one piece set mahogany. There's the neck joint right there. This bass did unfortunately have the uh, typical headstock break. Um, it came to me and it was supposed to be a stable repair. It was not, it failed in the case. Ben Bruton of Bruton Guitars, Rochester, New York, fixed this for me. If you need some, some work done, go see Ben. He does fantastic work. Look him up on Facebook. So here's what the bass sounds like. It's big, it's authoritative. It has a lot of treble and a lot of zip and a lot of zing, but there's always a fundamental low. Um, again, this is through a tiny little practice amp. I need to get something better. But for right now, it's gonna have to do. So here's a little bit of what she sounds like. I dig this bass a lot. I love all non-reverse Thunderbirds, don't let me fool you. But this is a special one, Big Red, 1966 Thunderbird 2 in Factory Cardinal Red. She's a keeper, hope you enjoyed it. I can't wait to take this bass out sta on stage with Who's That? So we're on to the next one. I'm on a roll here, so I'll be posting more videos for, uh, for you guys to check out. Until then, rock on.